Okay, so let's go over three circles. Now, remember, A means inside of A. Not B means outside of B. This means intersect. It means inside, or sorry, it means both. So inside of A and outside of B. And this means union. All right, now the unions are going to be easy and the intersects are going to be a little bit harder. A union just means shade more. When I have three, you need to remember that you're going to read this left to right. So I'm going to do this first and then I'm going to call this shaded. All right, let's do this first. Uh, A intersecting B, so inside of A and outside of B. The only section that is inside of A and outside of B is here. So that's the first two. So hopefully you've got the hang of doing your doubles. So you can do A and B very quickly. So that is the first shaded region. Now with unions, remember that union is easy. We just shade more. So I'm going to accept this or I'm going to accept anything inside of C. So with the union, I just shade all of C. So you shade everything inside of C. And you're done. You don't have to erase anything. Unions are easy. So if you have, if you know how to do your doubles, the triples aren't that hard when it's a union. It's just poof, shade more. In fact, I'm going to skip down to this question just to show you that again. So this is going to be union with C naught. So it means I'm just going to shade everything outside of C. But first, I'm going to do this. Uh, where does A naught intersect with B? So it means it's outside of A and inside of B. Okay, so I've got to be outside of A, which is somewhere outside here, and it's got to be inside of B. So inside of B, outside of A is there. Now hopefully that makes sense. Hopefully you can do your doubles. Inside of B is just inside that circle, but it has to be inside of B and outside of A, so it's just going to be this part. Okay, now I've got the shaded part. So since it's already shaded and unions are easy, I now just union with C naught, which means I'm going to accept this or anything that's outside of C. So shade more. This is why unions are easy. I don't have to erase anything. I just shade everything outside of C. Okay, so it looks kind of weird. Now, I'm just going to erase because I crossed some lines here. So it looks kind of funny. I've got this section right here that is inside of not C, but that happens with unions because I was accepting this or outside of C, we end up getting a piece that's inside of C. That's fine. It's allowed. So that's how unions work. Now, intersects. We're going to start with the same process. I always do this first. Uh, not A, so outside of A or inside of B. Remember, ORs are easy, so I'm going to do inside of B. I'm going to shade everything outside of A. Apparently, I'm running out of pencil. Everybody cool with what I just did? So I've shaded. B, I've shaded outside of A, and it's union, so I don't have to erase anything. I just shade them both. Unions are easy. Now, the intersect is a little bit harder here. So what this says is this says that it is shaded from doing this. So in the bracket is shaded. So it has to be shaded and inside of C. So just have a look. Which sections here are shaded and inside of C? Well, this one, this one, and that one. So everything else gets erased which is going to take up a lot of eraser because it just shaded that whole thing. Now make sure you do a good job of erasing or your teachers Taylor, will pick on you. Boom. Done. Okay, so that thing is shaded. So it was shaded and it's inside of C. That one's done. Next one, we're going to do that again. So A in union with B. So hopefully you guys know what this means. It means A or B. So I'm going to accept everything in A and I'm going to union it with B. Now I'm not going to work too hard because I know I'm, I'm not going to shade it too much because I know I'm going to have to erase some stuff because it's an intersection. Now I need shaded already and inside of C. 
Whoa, no, no, it's not, it's not C. So it's shaded already and outside of C this time. So which of these, all these sections are shaded and outside of C? Well, they're the ones that are outside of C, so it can't be inside C. So I'm gonna erase this. And remember, I'm only erasing because it's an intersection. I'm not erasing just because it was a knot. Remember me erasing for this one? That was an intersect with C and I erased. So you erase because of the intersection. I don't erase because it's a knot. I erase because it's an intersect. I had what was shaded already. I intersect it with outside of C, so it had to be shaded and outside of C, which are just those sections. All right, I hope that helps. Um, I had a note here for your last steps. If a union, just shade more. If intersecting C, then keep only what's already shaded and inside of C. If intersecting with not C, keep what's shaded already and what's outside of C. That's all you gotta remember.